You heard about keeping up with the Kardashians, but now you're gonna keep up with the Stallones. But guess what? Sly and his fam bam are going to have their very own reality show. Now, with this, Sylvester Stallone will reveal a new side of himself and his family. But will it be any good? The show, I mean, not Sly and his family's dynamics, obviously. Well, Paramount Plus announced that they'll release this new series this spring. So I suppose we'll find out soon enough. Not to mention, Stallone three daughters have made an effort to market the show by releasing a Super Bowl spot, a spot that shows them climbing the mountain of entertainment, a mountain with three faces, no less. But let's not go into specific details about that, because it had Stallone's face carved on it, and you'd have to watch this masterpiece yourself to really appreciate it. Either way, it seems like Stallone and his family are ready to get the Kardashian treatment. We'll finally get some insight into the Stallone household, with a seat at the table with one of Hollywood's elite families. So far, we've only ever seen Stallone in the iconic Rocky franchise, including his appearance in Creed as Adonis Creed's mentor. So seeing him in a different light will be refreshing. Talk to you in a minute. Oh, yeah, I, I got other plans in my life and this wasn't part of it. Your father was special. I named the boy and I see him. All the boys call and this will give the rest of the Stallones their time to shine. The show will not only introduce viewers to Stallone's wife, Flavin, the co-owner of a wellness brand called Serious Skincare, but also Stallone's daughters, Sistine and Scarlett, will also get a shot to be on screen. After years of wanting to work in the entertainment sector, Scarlett's already one step ahead of Sistine, though, because she's already a part of a drama series called Tulsa King with her dad. As far as the eldest daughter is concerned, Sophia isn't too interested in being an actor, but she does host a podcast called Unwaxed with Scarlett, though, so technically she's staying within the borders of the entertainment industry, but not like her sisters or dad. Either way, one thing's for sure, the family Stallone will give us a version of Sly that has never been witnessed before, excluding the mafia stuff, though. Duh. This reality show will probably uncover lots of things we've always missed out on, and it'll be the closest we'll ever get to the real Sly. Sure, we've seen him fight, but we've never really known much about his intelligence, humor, or anything else for that matter. As a matter of fact, if you ask any of the people who know Sly personally, he's as soulful as they come. He'll be showing off a different kind of muscle this time around, and I'm all for it. Now, what can we expect from this reality show? Well, with Sylvester Stallone's move to reality television, I suspect we'll learn more about how this iconic actor ended up with a bombshell like Jennifer Flavin. Sorry, Sly, don't come at me, but it's truly baffling. So I'm looking forward to learning more about the inside story of the Stallone family. Like we already know Jennifer filed for divorce in August 2022, but they seem to have buried the hatchet since then, and they're both happier than ever after reconciling in September. So we might learn a thing or two about that too, as well as how they managed to give birth to three beautiful daughters. We'll probably get a little sneak peek into their childhood too. That'll be fun. So it's all gonna happen this spring. Mark your calendars, people. It's something nobody asked for, but we're super grateful that it's happening, aren't we? I mean, who doesn't like Sly? Come on! Stallone is finally ready to showcase the greatest role of his life as a dad. And it's not just me saying it, he's said so himself in the description of the reality show. So if you want a sneak peek at the upcoming show, head on over to Paramount Plus to check out the teaser trailer to take a gander at that glorious mountain with Stallone faces. Or you could watch it at the Super Bowl happening soon, depending on when this video is uploaded. Or when you watch it, it might have already showed up. But if it hasn't yet, you're probably in for a treat at the Super Bowl. Now, here's why I think it's going to be good. Sly has actually defended his upcoming reality show, and this happened after people criticized this whole idea. So he came out and talked about how he's wasted a lot of time, and how he has very few bullets left in the gun. He's speaking metaphorically, obviously, referring to how he's getting older and older, and how now is a better time than any for this. Plus, look at it this way. Sly doesn't have the luxury of missing out on an opportunity like this, especially one with his family and kids. He's even confessed that not spending enough time with his family is his biggest regret. So why would he listen to the haters at this point? The same haters who have
have been going on and on about how he isn't a family man. Come on, dude. Also, this could be like Sly's ultimate home movie, a movie his kids could appreciate when he's no longer around and the time they spend working together. So more power to you, Sly. You do you. Haters gonna hate. And just FYI, before you go about thinking he might be in some sort of financial trouble, it's actually the opposite of that, because he has enough money to focus on a project like this, which is more rewarding in the spiritual sense than financial. And nobody can deny that reality TV is a big thing now. Sure, some celebrities prefer going to competitive shows, while others like to show off their life through documentaries, like KSI for example. JJ even talked about how he was bullied as a child in it. And while some of you might prefer watching those instead of reality shows, there are others who think documentaries are boring and actually prefer reality TV over them. But to be honest, to each their own. Either way, the family Stallone will show us what it's like to live as a Stallone, and it'll be fun to watch what it's like to be Rocky's daughter, or how Sly and his wife are like now after their recent marital problems. And I get it, it's a personal thing that should be left alone, even if it's a celebrity. But if the family Stallone gives us a look into the private life of one of the most famous actors, I'm making some fresh popcorn. And who knows, just like with keeping up with the Kardashians, there might be moments in there that are relatable, which will make watching it fun. Now, Stallone is ready to show the cameras what happens behind the scenes, more specifically what it's like to be a dad to three gorgeous daughters, and we'll get to know more about Flavin, and what it's been like being born and raised in LA, as well as how she came to be a co-owner of a skincare brand. Actually, you feel there. nice and smooth. I do. You smell, I actually, feel like a baby's bottom. I've decided that I just came here to uh, check out the products because I need help. I don't know if you know. No, you look yeah. fabulous. Yeah. No. <laughs> anyway, I know. Listen, I know when to get out of here. I've worn out my Oh, welcome. no, no, no. We love you, Sly. Thank you. you. Can come. We might even get to the bottom of why the eldest isn't really into acting. I mean, your dad is Rocky Balboa for crying out loud. How could you not like acting? Not to mention, have you seen her? She'd make an amazing actor especially with those looks. Even her sister Sistine is an actor, model, filmmaker, so I don't get why she's not interested in it. And Scarlett's part of the same drama series as their dad. That's probably gotta make her jealous, right? Either way, I guess we'll get to the bottom of it this spring. That was all about the new reality series. See you next time.